So with that said, let's jump into the other topic, which is Joker hits a billion dollars. Now, um, it's like <laughs> reviewers, journalists, everybody been like basically following it and just talking about how Joker just phenomenally, unexpectedly just took people by surprise and started off with a 60, what, $2 million budget and went on to conquer the box office and basically gave long legs and saying that, like, I'm about to reach that billion. I'm about to reach that billion. I'm about to reach that billion. Hey, I reached that billion, billion or whatever. And it has reached a billion. Domestically, as of when I wrote down these notes earlier this uh, week, it did $322.3 million. Worldwide, $1.018 billion. And it's crazy, like... It did more money than The Dark Knight. And to me, The Dark Knight was a way better film. But at the same time, Joker did over that. Not by a crazy, crazy amount, but, you know, it did a good amount over it. Uh, The Dark Knight did worldwide $1.004 billion. I don't think nobody expected it. And then what's crazy is that both of these movies, both of those movies... Have to do with the Joker. Have to do with the Joker. And, um, hey, both of them were played by actors that did the did the role well. That literally took that character and just skyrocketed on. Now, a lot of people might still look at Heath Ledger as the best Joker, but Joaquin Phoenix did an amazing job with being Joker. Did an amazing job. And, like, right now, it's the most profitable comic book movie of all time and the first the first r-rated film not r-rated comic book movie night comic book movie or anything else the first r-rated film to reach a billion dollars sit on that sit on that the first the most profitable out of all these movies that it came out out of all the comic book movies infinity war endgame uh, 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 Captain Marvel, Black Panther. It is the most profitable comic book movie of all time with a $62 million budget and made over a billion dollars. That's crazy. And the first R rated film that reached a billion dollars. That is nuts to even think about. And I'm, I'm glad that it did it because it was a really good film. I really did enjoy it. And Shit, if you haven't seen it yet, go ahead and check it out. It should, it's still in theaters. It should still be in theaters, having good times, late times, and all that stuff. It's not one of those where it gets close to the end of its like uh, theatrical run, where it's only playing uh, early screenings and the latest show be like 4, 8, 4 p.m. in the afternoon or in the evening or whatever. But it's still playing in good time, so you can go to a 9 o'clock show and all that stuff. Go check it out. Go check it out. Give it some more money. <laughs> but yeah, I mean, it's it's very surprising. Very surprising. 